I feel like I'm someone that like I have to prove myself and I have to prove that like I'm supposed to be here and like I can do this. I think confidence is a big thing and when it comes to pitching, I'm confident. I feel really good right now, and this team is like a really fun team to be a part of. I'm younger, but these are like the guys that I came through the Cubs system with, so it's, it's really fun to be around them. I'm really quiet and shy until like I get to know people, and like just having time with all the guys, it just makes it like more fun, and just, you can just be yourself more. Then you get to go out and pitch in front of these guys. You get to prove why you're like here as a young guy and, and it elevates your game. I'm from Fayetteville, North Carolina, which is a big like soldier town. It was basketball, baseball, football all my life. My dad's job was just practicing with me and making sure I was on top of it. And I think it instilled like hard work. Every day, even after like a tournament, I'd be like, dad, let's go hit or let's go throw some strikes. And when I got older, it just took off. I remember being 18 years old. I started getting invited to these pro workouts. Me, my dad, my mom, and my brother all drove up to Chicago that day. And when we got to Wrigley, when I walked onto the field, I was just blown away. That was the first time I ever seen a major league stadium. You could just feel like it was like kind of like home. Then the draft came and we heard from the Cubs and we were like, this is the decision we want to make. I just wanted somewhere where I could develop and I knew I could just take my game to the next level. I think Hers Day came up by some dude on Twitter. I think I was just scrolling on it one day and then it just started becoming a thing. Every time I would pitch, it would be like Hers Day and then the Pelicans were posting Hers Day and then the Southman Cubs were posting Hers Day. And I guess it's, it's just a thing now, Hers Day, but I'll take it. <laughs> My style of pitching in one word, I just feel like it'd be aggressive. When I step on the mound, it's just me versus you and, and I want to win that battle. Just being able to throw the, every pitch in the zone and not give as many free passes is my biggest thing that I've been working on in South Bend. My delivery is the biggest part of my game because it's just something so unnatural and unique that like nobody else has seen. There's so few of crossfire deliveries that actually can like do it. My delivery makes my fastball get on guys so much quicker. So when they have to focus on the fastball and being quick, I can drop the change up on them and it just opens my game up. And when I got my curveball, I just feel unhittable and my confidence is through the roof when I'm on the mound. So I didn't get to see my family from New Year's to Sunday. My dad drove 11 hours, came here like and then you have work the next day and then drove back 11 hours, like right after the game. He's, he's by far like one of the biggest reasons I'm here. I feel like I'm doing uh, a lot of this for, for my family, but I'm also doing it for myself. Just to prove that like, if you actually work and dedicate and love something a lot, you can go reach any of your goals. And from where I'm from, it's like, not a lot of people come out of that city, like big. It's like, you wanna put on for your city too. That's kind of like how we grew up. I know they're proud of me and I'm, I'm proud of myself. And I know we got a long ways to go and I'm super excited and I know they are too.